Anyways, with that, welcome back. We are the Vile Blip of this. Today we're playing some more Dark Souls 3. We're at the last tail end of this part of the DLC. We're gonna cut a bitch. I don't know if she's up here already, but um, this is where Arya is gonna go. I call her Arya because... Instead of saying her full name. She doesn't have her name. Oh, cool. The painter. Oh, there she is. Hey, hey girl. That's, all, that's her hair. She could use a comb. Oh, ooh, nice eyes. Yeah, she, it's very theorized that she's part dragon like Priscilla. Thou art Ash. Thou hast a pact made with Uncle Gale. So I wish to tell thee all. It's to be a cold, dark, and very but fair. I wish to paint a picture of a cold, dark, and very gentle place. One day... It will make someone a goodly home. That's why I must see flame. I wish to pick up one. That's why. Yeah. So, she's she has like scales on her legs, I think, or her feet, and she has like ripped eyes. And like, we don't know what part of the time this actually goes through, only because time and space is very distorted. Yeah. When you're in a so we don't know if that's like Priscilla's daughter or if that's Priscilla's mom. Or Priscilla. No, it can't be. And like, or younger Priscilla. Or younger, like that could be, I guess. Then she got really furry in her fucking. Oh. <laughs> Color face, mom. Gosh. Right. Call puberty, man. So what we're gonna do? Or it's sixteen. We're, we're gonna hit this this rock really hard. And I believe. So it's probably, it's probably just keep hitting the wall on the right wall. There's one wall that's fucking illusion. It's hard to tell, but it has like a doorway. That's not it. I feel like I've seen you do this before. Oh, it did. Wee! Right before the maggot came. And this is the cool part, because if you remember that place I fought uh, Priscilla? Yeah. That's it. But you can't get down. No, I can't. What? We're gonna. My leg. Yeah, you get, it's kind of hard to get here. You gotta... Oh, this is like the fucking... Yeah. This is like that spinning hallway in the Legend of Zelda <laughs> game. That's how, like, wonky it's making me. Platforming, not a good thing for Dark Souls. Why they keep putting it in there? I don't fucking know. Because apparently somebody's asking for it. And if you if you realize down there, that's why I fought the first boss. But this is the structure that uh, we're, they were on. Uh, oh, man, it's like farting flame. Ah, that's a fart. And then you get invaded. <laughs> Wait, come on, come on. <laughs> Guys, pyromancies are actually rather not at all. You had a bleed on his sword? Because that's a cantonet. <coughs> yeah, but this is the, the arena that you fight Priscilla. It's pretty cool. Um, there was usually more, like, more snow here, so you so can see her footprint. Dark, Dark Souls 1. Okay, I, I remember that. And when you kill Priscilla, she felt. I mean, not when you kill when you talk to her, she tells you just fall down and you'll teleport back home. And then, you know, that happens. I, I tried it. No. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> you're not going back home by falling down, Doug. I mean, if you lose a lot of health and you're like... Well, you die. No, that's well, you she, going back she, home. Yeah, she was right. <laughs> you just don't take the souls with you. Dark Souls 1, you go home. By falling. Dark Souls fucking 3, and are like, well, that's a fucking pit. I think they did that, that part the just to like fuck it? with you. It's like, oh, last time, let's see if it still works. Like, mm -hmm. th th there needs to be a bonfire there, honestly. To me, there needs to be a bonfire there. But if there's no bonfire there, you either, if you have no homeward bones or the fucking 
coil sword fragment, then you're gonna die there. Can you use well, no, homeward bones for something you, else? You picked up the homeward no. bone off of that guy. It's just for teleporting. What's the other bone that you get to use on? Uh, undead bone. Oh. Fragment or shards. But. Probably both. But uh, there's also another. There's like two more things to do on that rock. She thinks there's a, dog, do, a fucking dog contender after this. That's the secret door, dog. She's like, this motherfucker coming and touching my shit. Right? You don't see me going to your painting. <laughs> That's what yours does. <laughs> this is very fucking popular, dog. He doesn't paint! No! <laughs> She's like, you paint these guilty. She's gonna cover it over. Her ashes will be ever seeking fire. Honestly, these fucking bubbles are pretty sweet. Dude, Like, if there's one thing that Dark Souls is famous for, it's their first DLC having a few bots. This one. And in Dark Souls 1, Artorias, and Bloodborne, Maria. Yo, Maria. Oh, dude, Maria is fucking lit. This boss is actually ridiculous. But. She's a humanoid type boss. Meaning she's a person. She can be parried, she can be backstabbed, she can be interrupted. She yeah, man, she's people side. She can be DPS and bled. Every boss can be bled, but now a boss is gonna be like, oh, he hit me three thousand times. Oh. Most bosses are all like, you hit me three thousand times. How <laughs> dare you? So she staggers she staggers. So what we're gonna do is get our best, our mm -hmm. best handmade gear. Yeah. Straight up mecha. Wait, how? Wait. There it is. Wait. <laughs> I will stick with the silver knight because I am a big, a big dude I am. Uh, let's see what kind of helmet. I kind of want to keep this because it's a cool helmet. Shave off a little bit of armor, you know what I'm saying? Grind it against a couple of stones. I don't like the key. Sit down. You, know, you like you got a nice dress. Though. I don't like that shit. You got a nice fucking kitty. We'll get a bronze. Bronze. Bronze! Okay, ready? Just like a song. Also, this Gale. Hey, that's a nice. Yeah, that's a nice sword you got. Yeah. 
the executioner blade. It looks very dull. Like it had a lot of use recently. Be forewarned, eager Ash. Should this world wither and rot, even then would Ariandel remain our home. Leave us be, Ashen One. Thou art the Lord of Londor, and have thine own subjects to guide. If you do the whole Lord of like Lord of Hollow shit like I am, she'll say that. She wouldn't say that any like any other time. Leave us. Basically, she's like, this ain't your home. Get away from my home. Yes, and you got better shit to do. Flickering, flickering. Flickering. Not enough blood yet, she. My flail. Bring me my flail. My heart. Ah, what stalks thine ears? This is a giant mimic. Why is he so Please. My flail. Right away. So that's a Lord Vessel. If you, are, if you know Dark Souls, you know Lord Vessels are the reason we can teleport. It's the reason why big things happen. Big Lord Souls go in Lord Vessel to light big fire. Uh, oh. Bring Frida to me, please. Cause thou not see the flame flickering once again. Sheen blood surge. I can see it. Feel it. So, this place needs fire to burn away, so the rock can go away. Um, Frida has been telling this guy, uh, we're gonna turn off that fire with your blood. Flail, and then he flails himself like a, like a Catholic priest, and we have no blood goes into the floor vessel. Tis only the flame quivering that misguided yeah. ash. So she told him that the only way to bring the Please avert thine eyes. Well, yeah, it's, like, suggestions turn into that. I will snuff out these ashes for good. Yeah, so. I like her weapon of choice. Sister Freak. So I'll show off what she's doing before I try my stuff. I'm gonna have to cut down the water a little bit. Wait, that's a cool ass. That's a trash guy. So she, she deals frostbite. Oh, yeah. Well, this is the part I'm talking about. She teleports, she jumps, and then... She, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna block it. She, you, you would literally get dumped on. Oh, stop. More like... Yo! That's just like, yeah! Essentially. She has some combos, well, some jump attacks. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So she jumps like 10 feet. Like uh, Priscilla, you'll figure out. Anyways, you'll figure out where she is by looking at the floor, see if snow goes on a lot. That is happening. Fuck that. Is happening. You gotta figure out when she, like, where she is when she's in the school. She gets very interrupted. That's, that's my super Other than that, she's pretty cool. The frostbite game. Extra attacks, the combos. But if you know exactly where she's gonna go... Or when to listen for her attacks, then you're pretty much golden. She does steps when she attacks, so your best way to evade her is to roll forward. You, you should be always rolling forward when you're attacking. Return from whence thou camest. Uria surely awaits thee. Yo, she's got some nice size. Yeah. And now I try. The shame she didn't call you a dog at dinner. Yo, you could never let that go. <laughs> Yo, that was the coolest insult I've ever heard. Like, he called you a dog, but not really. 
And he did it in such like an old, old time beat. Also, when you start right? fighting her, you know. I mean, not, not she, she gets out of her chair. Obviously. Because she's like, I have nothing more to say to you. Essentially. She's in full fight mode. She says, square up. <laughs> Essentially. And you're just like, I'm just a pile of water. I would love my soul back. Yes. She does a lot of jumps. I wouldn't recommend back attacking her unless you know you can. The swipes are also close. Yeah, she knows how to dodge, so if you want to be chasing. are very good, so you need to realize where... That was an accident! But we killed her. Woo! Oh, it is loud. Basically. She dies. And a certain song only happened a while And then he's like, oh, it's not He goes like, bro, why did you say that? No, his scream is actually really powerful. Closed hallway area. There's a big place there. Now, unlike the person dog fight, they do share health. would say, if you have a pal with you, you know, the pal is going to be officially one shot me but she did currently yeah attack me once and I died. It's cause she has a, a scar, like a wind scar. But um it makes like a how do I explain? A cone and that's frozen. And it does a little bit of damage and then it gives you frostbite and then it explodes and kills you. And then you just something like Yeah, essentially. And then you take down notes and you just like, I want to use these notes that I learned. 
fuck, it's time for the test. Okay. And then the test throws a new question, and you're like, I didn't study for this in class. Part of my training. So you try to look it up on your phone, and what is this? And you can repeat the process until you put it in the test. This is when you start learning how to manage your emotions. You notice how, like, when you're blocking your hands, it goes very small. Yeah. Your endurance doesn't go fill very fast when you're holding up your shield. So what you want to do is block the attacks you can. This is the only time where I recommend you summon Slave Knight Gale. Actually, the there's there's one. there's another time where I would recommend you summon Slave Knight Gale. Problem. Every time you call somebody to help you, the boss's health will increase. Or very significantly. Now the only reason that would be any kind of fucking good is because Oh, Slave Knight Gale attacked them, they're gonna aggro him. They'll charge up a fucking every attack. And they'll aggro you, Slave Knight Gale attacks, they'll aggro him, rinse right. and repeat, boss is going too. Problem, Slave Knight Gale can die. And this is actually the wrong boss for him. So, near the third or second phase, he does die. Does he human? No, he's very human. This is like. No, it says he's not a human. Yeah, he's a filthy AI? Essentially. He'll try to heal when he's getting attacked. Obviously, that's, that's just a thing. That's how you break her. respect. <laughs> that's why I'm trying to be Barry King, man. That's my fault. I almost died. I'm so dead. Yo! <laughs> this man. No help. Yeah. Gulp, gulp, gulp. Yeah. The juice. So what you
you want to do is distract her. She gets as cool as Maria. It's called in Dark Souls 1, but th there's a new element after the DLC came out. It's dark element, and it's not fire, but it is fire. And it's it deals, basically what Artorias had? It deals dark damage, and I don't have any kind it, of it fucking... It's called, uh, I think it's a, uh, Al Amaterasu? <laughs> no. Is that what it? Uh, the good fuck? The good son? <laughs> like, this shield's supposed to block fire damage. The shield blocks dark damage. Guard absorption. This shit blocks fucking dark damage, but that's a big shield, my guy. <laughs> oh man, I wonder what Oliver does. Oh, he's taking a shared ride. So I might as well show this off since I'm not gonna win. So they realized that, you know, two people fighting Frida on her first form is kind of unfair. So then they made everything else unfair. No. He doesn't appear until you beat Frida's first form. That's actually not bad. That way you have room to fight with, um... Yeah, you have full health yeah. for the important shit. But he still dies by the time Frida fucking <laughs> goes to third form. And this is the only boss in Dark Souls history that has three forms. Oh, it doesn't go. Yeah, that's 
that's why I was like, yeah, that's cool. Oh, it's because the second scythe that glows. Oh, that guy? Her original scythe is the one with the black part. Now you have Some of her blue ones. Now, this is what I recommend. If you have Gale, I recommend you have Gale attack for you. And you attack him. Yeah. But unfortunately, no matter who you attack, they're both gonna fucking target you. And you can't control him, obviously. bitch that we just talked to, Rosaria, she has a very important thing that is, is it new to this game? I'm gonna say it's new to this, this series, but it's probably not. So, fuck people who are gonna roast me in the comments. There's not that many people, anyway. So, you can talk to her and she'll put you back to the level you were. And you can, you can spend all those souls back, like, relocating. Oh, so, hypothetically, to you. hypothetically, I've been big dick string. But if I had a sword that I like that goes black fire, reorient myself again. You go to oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Intelligent orangutan noises. Yeah. <laughs> Ashen one, thou then I am a thousand. Very then. I didn't put on my health, I put on my vitality. Now you're probably gonna talk to me and be like, that's the same fucking thing. So what's vitality? 
Oh. Carry weight. So what's health? Vigor. I thought it'd be swan. I feel you. Oh no, man. I didn't make me. I still can't wear fucking good clothing. <coughs> I want my bros and my bros arms, dog. Look at these anchor arms. Look at these fucking anchor arms, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> For seek work, bro. Also, you know, if you did, if you notice, when you kill three or second form, you get a titanite slab, and that's pretty cool because titanite slabs are very fucking finite. Oh, that's cool. She gives you a not a rare candy. out your weapons if you think you maxed out the wrong weapon you know you have chances this spell is fucking ridiculous tears of denial grant one chance to endure it with hate yeah that's cool everyone and i mean everyone fucking uses this on D pvp and now because of that it's kind of like this chris you know how everyone fucking kaijus and now they have things that can't be tributed yeah the this is, this is the kaiju, and the thing that can't be true, it's called thorn armor. Thorn armor, helmet, armor, or hands, or legs, when you roll, you do one damage. Guess where they're at? You roll into them. Baggots. <laughs> Ashen one. Yo, what? A get out of jail free card. You gotta tell Yuri you killed her sister? Yeah. And then she's gonna be like... That dogged bitch. Ah, <laughs> t'was the soul of my sister, Elfrida. A poor wench turned to ash, who would abandon Londo. If thou wouldst, let it nourish thy lordship, and in return, do her once more kindness. Remember those who stayed by her to the end, in the shadows cast by fire. And lastly, my lord, take up thy rightful mantle of usurper. Yo, she's fat bars, nigga. Oh lord, I when the the she gods of honor. roasted them. Honorable, so that I like we... This chair. She straight up said they fucking suck. Thank you. And obviously, um, you, you kill Frida, so you get her soul, and you can make a cup. I, I think you can make two things. Well, the first <laughs> thing is obviously her sight. Thank you for taking out the trash. Here he is. Ooh. There's her sight. Ooh, it's too oh, horrible. shit! And then you can make the, the, the father's flail. Oh, it's not the, it's not the pot, nigga. <laughs> it's not the pot. <laughs> Look at his weapon art. By the bulbous father of the painted flail. Awakening. Yeah. Violently flail <laughs> oneself to trigger an awakening that temporarily boosts the strength of miracles. Just as the good father used to grow his son. So, when you use weapon art, your character goes on his knees. <laughs> you do damage to yourself to strengthen miracles. So, I'm good. So, I am obviously just gonna to show you what that is about. I don't think it has a very. I'm surprised it didn't cost that much. Well, I still can't use it. I don't have the intelligence to pay for it. Oh well, yeah, it's the side. Well, at least you get to use one. And then use your 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 weapon art. But uh. Not enough smart. Yeah, not enough smart. He'll he'll pull out the second one if you're smart enough. Oh, uh, I. You see that? The blade is smartness. That sorcery blade. <laughs> That's why it was glowing. But without that, it's pretty trash. <laughs> Or that, yeah, or that. See, it's sorcery. It can be like... Yo! <laughs> but you know me. I wish WoW did more stuff like that. Like, you fight a boss, you take their fucking weapon. Like, it's a low chance to drop, because obviously it's a low Like, Dark, Dark Souls 3 started the whole fucking... In the, ser in the Dark Souls series, the whole... If you kill an enemy, no matter what they're fucking wearing, they're gonna drop that. Dark Souls 1 didn't do that. I think 2 kinda did it. But now it's like, if they have a thing, you can kill them enough and get that thing. 
it's pretty cool. Um, but what's pretty cool <laughs> is that we're going to end this until next time. Let's play Dark Souls 3. <laughs> Woo! We'll see you next time when, uh, if you notice, when we kill three of them. Two. Ooh, another. Another. And then another. And we're going to see what that second one leads us. Oh. Until then. Woo! Bye, guys. Well, bye now. Bye.